Just give me a sense of how concerned you are about currency fluctuations. I'm thinking of a pound. I'm thinking of peso. Does it make your life that much more difficult? Uh, good morning, Francine. Um, we are used to deal with uh, fluctuating exchange rates. And uh, normally, we are well balanced. That means that we have uh, impact on the absolute figures, but not on the relative performance. All right, how do you prepare? So you're, um, of course, a worldwide uh, very known tire maker. How do you prepare for possible trade wars? What's, first of all, the possibility of a trade war, something ugly like a trade war between the US and China? And what does it mean for your supply chains? Well, we appreciate and uh, we are supporting free trade. Uh, basically, we, we are convinced that uh, free trade can help to save jobs and uh, will create wealth for all parties involved over time. So um, if a trade war would start, there would be no winners and losers. There would be only losers existing. It would create the industry, the whole industry, the automotive industry, including Continental, with a difficult time. You cannot really prepare for that. We have to wait how the uh, concrete decisions of the US government will look like. It's too early to say. But uh, we had such situations in the past. And uh, you have to be fast and agile to be able to adjust your, your, uh, your business accordingly. Uh, but at the other side, we are investing long term. Um, so we cannot simply take a facility located somewhere and move it to another market or country. That simply doesn't work. Uh, we are so dependent on our suppliers. Our customers are uh, uh, dependent heavily on, on uh, our locations. Um, if, if the cost situation would be negatively impacted by, by, this, uh, by, by uh, decisions, right. Of, of a US government or, or uh, another government, the consequence would be we would have to raise prices probably. And that right. would be negative for the consumers.